Hey, what's up guys, MGH here, and welcome back to my Rage to Glory. Now, as you can see, the team I've got is looking pretty good. However, I haven't progressed much since I got my massive upgrades, being Sherla and uh, Costa up front. Now, I got Koscielny. A lot of people were a little bit angry at me, actually, for getting Koscielny. Thinking I got him just because I'm an Arsenal fan and that I'm biased towards him. It might be a little bit, but if I'm honest, guys, Koscielny for me is one of the best centre-backs in the game, and that is why I got him. However, in today's episode, even if I don't win these next two games, I still want to do something exciting. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back on the Topps Kick 15 app. I'm going to open up some more packs, and from those packs, if I get someone that is a really good gold, you know, a rare gold player in the game, then I'm going to basically do a pink slip game, where if I win it, I get to keep that player. If I lose it, I have to discard a player. So we're going to do exactly what I did before. Um, so let's open up the app and hopefully I'm going to get some good players. So here we go. We're in the store now. Obviously, like I mentioned before, this, this app is basically like Ultimate Team where you collect players, you collect cards. So I'm really hoping I'm going to be able to grab someone good in these BPL score packs. Let's turn down the app so you don't have to hear that. Let's see if we're going to get someone good. Okay, Alex Bruce at first. Rojo could be a decent defender to get. And Michael Williams, not a very good pack. Adrian, good goalkeeper, but maybe not for me. Ben Me um, and Craig Dawson. I'm not getting lucky at all right now. Let's keep going until I get at least one really good rare gold player. And then we'll play that game and hope that I perform. Uh, okay, Felipe Luis. He could go at left back. That's the winner so far. Didier Drogba. I've got Costa. And Diego Costa himself. So three Chelsea players in one pack. So uh, for me, Felipe Lewis could be a very, very good left back to replace Shaw. So he's winning at the moment. Okay, we've got Punchin, Trippier and Jan Matt. Okay, I still think Felipe Lewis is winning right now. I'm going to spend at least another 30,000 coins and try and get someone good. I want like a Yaya Toure. That'd be amazing. Steven Island, Diame and Sacco. Okay, Sacco's pretty decent. Please give me someone good in this one. Please. Ozil. Meza Ozil could be the new cam. Holy shit. Tadic is very good. So maybe, maybe I should go for Louise. Oh, I don't know. So guys, I have decided to go with Ozil just because I think that he's a better upgrade than Louise. 82 rated left back. One of the best in the Premier League, I guess. But then again, Di Maria is pretty much the only other cam that, that rivals Ozil, if you ask me. Probably a little bit better as well. Um... Di Maria, but obviously a lot more expensive. So I've gone with Ozil. In this game, if I win, I get to keep him. However, if I lose, I have to discard him and another player. So I'd really rather not lose the game with him. So let's get into our first match and uh, hopefully we'll get matched up with someone who's pretty useless. As you can see at the bottom there, guys, I only need one more win to secure promotion and open up a gold pack and then another win to win the title, which I'd very much like to do. So here is my next opponent, and it's a very, very strong squad. Oh, God. Okay, the back four isn't as strong as it could be. Vlas there. Cahill's pretty decent, though. This is going to be an interesting game with Boney and Jovetic up front. Holy shit. This hasn't been a good start at all. I took kickoff as well, and he's got the ball straight away. You sweaty prick. One minute in, and he scored already. That is terrible from me. Absolutely terrible. Come on, Ozil. Yes. Find that pass. Oh, it's beautiful. His first assist, maybe. It is. Diego Costa. 500 coins, baby. Whew. That's a relief. But Ozil gets his assist and Diego Costa gets his goal. Come on, Ozil. Let's get that other assist now. He's done it. <laughs> two assists and now two goals for Diego Costa. Absolutely fantastic, Ozil. Two assists on his debut and we're barely into this match. This is dangerous. Wilfred Bonny's through, and it's 2 all. It's as simple as that. Here goes Ozil again. Can I pick out a pass? Of course he can. That's a really nice boy over there to Diego Costa. He's muscled through. Play it in. Come on. No. Yes. Moses off the post. Yes. We got the goal, guys. Wait, who is it? Is it Schneidlin? I think it's Schneidlin out of position. He's pushing up the pitch. I don't know why, but we do get the third goal. This game is mental right now. Still time for another one here. Here goes Schurler. That's a foul. Oh, we've got a free kick in a good position here. Do I give it to Diego Costa? Try and get him the hat trick? Or do I go with it with Ozil, who's got a very good left foot? 
Let's see Diego Costa's stats. I might be able to do this. His free kick actually is 59. Nah, there's no chance. I'd rather take it with Ozil and try and bend this one in the top right corner. There we go. Ozil gets it. He is absolutely fantastic. Come on, Ozil. Hat-trick of assists, maybe. What a ball. Diego Costa off the bar. That was his hat-trick right there. Oh, what a ball for the hat-trick, Costa. Oh, my God, Chesney. He is having the game of his life right now. Ozil over the top for Costa. Hat-trick. Yes, there's the hat-trick, guys. We've done it. Automatic upgrade, and it looks as if we will be holding on to the three points as well. So we'll be keeping Ozil. We'll be getting an automatic upgrade. Through ball. Oh, it's too easy. Diego Costa. And it's another goal. Simple as that, guys. 6-2. Another goal for Costa. Another assist for Ozil. Looks like he's rage quit. Oh, dearie me. I make that 2,200 coins, no? Yeah, 2,200 coins. Plus 500 for the rage quit. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I've just checked something. A rage quit is 1,000 coins. That's a lot more than I thought, and it's actually 3,200 coins. And we get to open up a pack. Holy shit, it's all going for me right now. So we're going to open up the uh, the pack first. Let's see if I can get a rare gold. Come on. No. It doesn't look like I'm going to get anyone from the Premier League. We have actually got two players from the Premier League, but they are not rare golds, which is a shame. But I can still have them in my club, I guess. Why not? So here is my automatic upgrade. I've decided to go with Quadrado. Now, a lot of people would have thought I'm going to go for Sanchez, but I'm going to change it up. I just got Ozil, another Arsenal player. And I've already got quite a few Chelsea players, actually, now that I've thought about it. But either way, he's a brand new signing in the Premier League and I want to use him. So, Quadrado, welcome to the team. The next player I've decided to buy is 2,400 coins worth of left back. And that is Clichy from Man City, the ex-Arsenal man. He's been very good in Ultimate Team for a long time, so I thought... Why not? Let's try him out, and I've still got some coins to spend. I've got 800 coins left, guys, and it seems like a no-brainer to go with Coleman. He's a really good player, and uh, he will go straight into the team, no problem. So, the upgraded Coleman, by the way, and that is all the coins gone. So, as you guys know, just one more win, and we win the Division 7 title. And there's only four more players left to upgrade before I start trying to get some informs. Um, but basically, guys, this last game here today, I just want to win it so I can open up that pack and start Division 6. Here's my next opponent and an 84-rated team. Oh, my God. That is... Ugh. That makes me sick. Look at those front three. Oh, what have I got myself into? The only positive I can see about playing this guy is he's got three at the back. And there's a penalty. I can't fucking handle the pace. Top right corner, please. Ah, oh, mm. bollocks. 1-0 down already. Through ball. Oh, 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 come on. No, Neuer. <laughs> Not only I've got to get through his team and defend against him, I've got to score against freaking Neuer. Oh, I'm through. Please, this time. How is Neuer so quick off his line? It's ridiculous. Go on, Ozil. Go on, Ozil. Go on, son. Inside. Yes, he's through. Finesse. Ozil's shot was absolutely terrible. Right, that's half time. The fact that it's only 1-0 says a lot about my defending. I think I've actually coped okay. Alex Song, I see a run. That's a good ball. That's a really good ball. Come on, Costa. Can't beat Neuer. Oh, go on, Quadrado. Over to Ozil. Head that. Yes, Ozil. Yes, finally he's done it. After all his terrible attempts, he scores a header. It doesn't make sense to me, but I don't care. We've got the goal that gets us back in this match. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Come on, Costa. Smash it, son. <laughs> he actually almost got it on target. I think it was. <laughs> That's Ibarbo for you guys. Absolute joke. Absolute fucking joke. Own goal. I'm through though. Still time. Finish that. Right, we're back in it. Two minutes to go, guys. Can I get the equaliser? Unfortunately, guys, it's game over and I've lost the game. I don't think that's fair. I want to take a look at these stats and see, but 
Honestly, I've never come up against such a pace abuser in my life. That was ridiculous. I think that says it all, really. I had more possession, even though he just played it down the wings and just carried on running. But I had more shots. The same on target. One of his shots and goals was a penalty. I feel a little bit hard done by, but that's all right. It's the way the cookie crumbles. In the next episode, we'll have to try and win the title then instead. So thank you so much for watching, guys. No more upgrades, but I made some great ones in the first match, so I'm okay with that. And uh, I'm not too angry, so whatever. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to hit that thumbs up button if you've enjoyed it, and subscribe if you haven't already. Please do follow me on Twitter as well. I think I'm almost at 115,000 followers, so if you could follow me, that'd be absolutely great. And uh, my Twitch name is exactly the same. It's at OfficialMGH. Thank you, guys, and I will see you next time.